Hey guys, welcome back. Kyle Dimon here, Bullion RV, Duluth, Minnesota. And today we have a brand new Imagine from Grand Design. It's a 25 BHE. We'll get you on the outside, we'll get you inside and see what you think. I'd like to start right up front here with the front cap. As you can notice, it's got a really nice rock guard down here to protect the front of your camper from those rocks spitting up off the road. We got two 20 pound LP tanks that are full that we will we fill up uh, included in the deal here. Power tongue jack up front. We got light on board. And then we're also going to include a 27 deep cycle marine grade battery. Going to live right there with a battery box right behind the propane tank. So all that's included in the deal. Right around on the back side of the camper, we'll get you into the water station here. So what's really great is you got this section here. You can run all your hoses up through uh, that guy, plug them all in, be able to close the door. This is where your satellite cable is all hooked up. You also have your battery disconnect in here and you have a hot and cold shower in here as well. Also, what's great with these pass-through storages is you got a couple lights in here. Those are set up for, you can turn them off all the time, you can leave them on all the time, or you can set it on a motion. So if you're coming in here with your gear, open the door, that light will turn on for you. So that's gonna be really awesome that you don't have to worry about all that. You're gonna notice it's gonna have four uh, stabilizer jacks on all four corners. These are the crank down. Trick of the trade, bring a little three quarter inch bit, zip those down with an impact wrench, makes life a lot easier for you. One good size slide on this unit really is going to open it all up. This unit's coming in at about just under 30 feet total length and about 6,250 pounds. So super half ton towable. And again, with it being a little shorter, this big slide makes a lot of space in there for you. On the back side, under one of these bunks, you're going to have a little more extra outdoor storage for you on this side, along with your Furion hot water heater. This is a tankless hot water heater. So endless hot water if you get the campground, that's gonna be awesome. On the back side, Grand Design is putting ladders to the roof, fully walkable roofs. So you get the ladder up there, 300 pound capacity. Be able to check your seals, see what's going on up there with the ladder on board, that's gonna be great. With this unit in the bunkhouse, you got this little escape door, fire door, uh, storage door. Be able to get the kids' bikes in there, um, extra storage, extra gear. That's gonna be really awesome. Then again, you also have another motion light in here too. So if you're loading stuff up in early morning, late at night, you got that light in there. This does have a deadbolt on it. So when you do have it closed, safety for the kids, you got a deadbolt lock, all that stuff. Also on the back, you got a nice spray port. So this is gonna be almost like a cold, cold shower hose, you know, cold hole shower. Um, so spray port, you know, again, you have all the kids, you got pets, you spray out the kids, the dogs, the toys before you load them all in. That's gonna be really great for you. And then up top, you are prepped for a backup camera. So if that's something you wanna add, great. If you got family members that are essentially your backup camera, you can do that too, but having that on board and having it prepped and ready for you is a really great option. Outdoor kitchen on this unit. Um, that's one nice thing about bunk houses is they got the outdoor kitchens. They hide them right under there. This is all wrapped up, but it is a one piece flat top grill, like a cast iron flat top grill. Great for pancakes, eggs, bacon, all that stuff in the morning. Keep all those smells out here. Wake up the campground, make your friends. It's got three different burn zones, so you can really customize it. I think that's awesome. You got a backsplash on here, so it really keeps all the stuff out of the camper. When you want to close it up, you just fold this down. Then you also have storage, there's a light, so a couple extra things in here for you as well. And then these just lock down for travel. You also have a nice little mini fridge out here too, so no more running in out of the camper. Keep some beverages out here for the kids, for the family. On the front side, you're gonna have your black tank flush, your cable hookups, you got some power out here. So if you wanted to put maybe a little TV, have movie night, game day, you get all your hookups and everything right here for you. Notice the great big awning out front, so you get back from a long hike, day at the beach, sunny out, you want to get some shade, get the awning, the LED strip that runs under the whole awning gives you some great light as well. And again, here's that hose for the back spray port, and then for the shower on the other side. And then again, this is the other look of the pass-through storage. Check out the space that you have on the Grand Design Imagines for the pass-through storage doors. I mean, camp chairs, anything you want to fit in there. Really nice, big, open space here. They're all held up by a magnet. 
So again, if you have a bunch of little kids, you're never gonna break those little plastic clips on here ever again. Magnets are a great option. We'll swing inside. As we're going in, you'll notice the big grab handle, the three steps that bring it down so your first step's not as high as some of the other campers. Uh, the big grab handle to help you get in, which is gonna be really great. Also, again with the bunk houses, having a lot of people spot to throw all your shoes, your sandals right out of the way so you're not tripping over those as you walk in. As you'll notice, this is a Murphy bed unit. So it gives you extra seating, extra storage, and that bed is super simple to use. All you gotta do is just take this guy, fold it over. This has the one latch on this side. Bed just drops down. Really simple, really easy to use. You got reading lights, you got a nice little shelf up top. Notice the blue ambiance light. It's kind of fun. Each side's gonna have its own cubbies with power and USB to plug in your devices. A lot of great storage. So you're gonna have hanging storage on both sides of the camper. You're gonna have storage doors on both sides of the camper. And then as you come down here, more storage. And then below that, there's more plugins. So again, if you wanted to plug in your devices and kind of leave them here, you got a lot of stuff. If it's a CPAP machine that you need to fit in that cubby, you got a lot of options to go for you in here. You know, in the morning, again, it's just as easy as that. Fold up the bed, fold this guy back, and you're back to maximum seating in the camper. Really easy to use. You know, with the family, you're down by the water, you're doing some hikes, you're doing all that kind of stuff. You come back, you just want to rest. These, both of these chairs are going to have heat and massage in them. So kick back, turn on the heat, turn on the massage, kick your feet up right across from the TV. Really nice. You got your table here too for the kids. So having snacks, playing games, things like that. You're going to have this section right here. What I like about this table, it's almost like the quick release bike seats. So a couple quick releases right here. We'll just drop down this table and pull it up. No more of those unsturdy bars, trying to find them, get them in the spot, put the table back. Everything is just right here for you. You're not gonna lose any pieces. So that's gonna be really awesome. Up in these cabinets, here's gonna be your uh, main station, the motherboard. You got all your lights, check your tanks, batteries. This is Bluetooth connectable. So you can run a lot of the stuff from your phone to you download the Quick Connect app or the Compass Connect app and be able to do a lot of that stuff from your phone, which is awesome. Furion, Bluetooth, uh, HDMI, USB, all that stuff with your radio right here. Couple little things, you got the storage door on this side as well. Couple little hooks, throw some hoodies, sweatshirts, maybe kids goggles, you know, whatever you want going on here. Nice little pantry. I mean, that's deep deep pantry so even though it's a little skinnier it is deep so you can actually fit a lot of stuff in there um, and kind of get at that as you need to also notice there is no in-floor uh, heat grates everything's going to be coming up off the floor so with the kids sand dirt pets none of that stuff's going to get stuck in there you're also not cutting holes to uh, mess with the integrity of the floor as well so that's gonna be really nice the new units are coming with 12 volt refrigerators Couple great things with that is the refrigerator and freezer are a lot bigger. Um, the size of this freezer, this camper got plugged in, I don't know what, 10 minutes ago maybe. You can already feel the freezer getting cold, which is gonna be awesome. The refrigerator has a ton of space in it to fit everything. When you're running down the road with the truck, having that plugged in the truck, the fridge is running. Um, it's just a great, great option. This kitchen layout is gonna be really awesome for you. You got the counter extender here, windows on this side. You got a nice pull out drawer for your pots and pans and extra storage right down on the bottom. And again, once you get in one of these grand designs, you can really feel the quality of the build with the solid cabinet doors, solid wood core doors on them. Um, and they just have a really nice look and feel to them. You got vents, um, one here, one in the bathroom, one in the bunkhouse. It is ducted for AC throughout the whole camper as well. So kind of cool everything down for you. The bathroom, um, porcelain toilet in the bathroom, which is gonna be great for easy cleaning. Um, you got a nice spot for towels. You got towel hangers, a really great medicine cabinet. 
a really nice size shower in there. Counter space on um, above by the sink to kind of set some of your stuff to get ready in the morning. Uh, maybe you're out heading, taking your camper. Hotels are crazy expensive, so you're going out to family wedding, family get-togethers, you don't want to rent hotels. This is a great option, nice bathroom to get ready in for you. You need a little more space for prepping. You got this countertop, super easy to use, couple clips on the bottom, drop that right down, really nice. This bunkhouse section is awesome. You can sleep four people back here. Um, this one bunk does flip up. Uh, this is the only bunk that flips up. So if you're a little bigger adult or something like that and don't want to crawl under and feel super claustrophobic like that, if there's just three of you, you can sleep on this side and have a lot more space, which is going to be really great. Power, USB lights on all the bunks. A lot of great storage coming down on the bottom. So you have a lot of storage drawers down here, uh, little cubbies down here. Again, plug-ins, lights everywhere back here. We got a bunch of windows back here for ventilation on both sides. So you can open these windows up, you can open the vent up. So it might feel like a small space, but you're gonna get a lot of air ventilation and you're not gonna feel claustrophobic or get that stagnant air and start getting hot. I mean, the window in the back, the door in the back does have a screen door on it as well. So you can really open this space up and get a lot of air back here and make it feel really comfortable for the whole family. A small travel trailer like this, you're sleeping four people back here, two up in the main bed, maybe one or two depending on the size of people on that couch. So in a 30 foot travel trailer to be able to sleep up to eight people is a great option, especially it's half ton towable, get into all the state parks, really, really great travel trailer. Um, so that's our quick video. If you haven't already hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Helps us out, helps you out, if you're, especially if you're searching, kind of get all those videos out to you right away. We're doing our best job here to get them out as fast as we can. So really appreciate if you kind of help us out and help grow our channel. So again, my name is Kyle Dittman. I'd love to work with you, help you answer any questions. Give me a call at 218-740-4964. Thanks, have a great day.